Hi everyone, I am about to do a house tour as was very, very requested on TikTok and Instagram. Everyone wanted to see the inside of the new house. But before I showed you guys that, I really wanted to take a minute to tell you how this came about. See, the thing is that we are, we got a horse recently, a miniature horse, and we were supposed to put him um, in a stable or on a friend's property. And we just got really attached to him. We really wanted to keep him with us. And as you know, COVID progresses, you know, we are spending more and more time at home. We have a very energetic little one now. Um, as you guys have seen, Lily is almost two. She's very, very hyper. And so constantly running around, destroying everything. Um, our previous home was kind of not kid proof at all. I mean, it had lots of ups and downs and it had an exposed loft that she could fall off of the second floor and stuff. So it was a little bit scary for me. So I'd been thinking about moving for a while. Um, couple that with a little bit of paranormal activity that we might have experienced and we were we were definitely searching for um, a new place. So that being said, um, the primary reason was, you know, just a life lifestyle shift. I want to have more animals, more room for animals. I want to have um, lots more land. I just want to go back to kind of a simpler feeling of just being outdoors a lot with my little girl. Um, during COVID, I've seen her get more and more dependent and addicted to screen time. And I want to do my best. You know, I'm only human, but I want to do my best to kind of raise her outdoors and, and not in front of a screen. So this house was an attempt to do that. And we were looking for farms. We were looking for ranches. It was really difficult to find something in our budget, um, in our area, not too far from work. And even this house is really far from my husband's job. It's like an hour away, but he made the sacrifice for us. Um, he said, you know, if this makes you guys really happy, I'm willing to do the drive. So that being said, we closed on the house yesterday and um, don't mind the mess. There's already a lot of boxes in place. We're moving things inside. It's a little bit upside down. There's no furniture. Renovations are going to have to happen. But before we get into all of that, I did want to show you guys uh, the place. So let's go. All right. So when you walk in, you've got your staircase. Um, the first thing that you see, this is actually going to be my office right here. So we got our books in place. We always move our books first for some reason. So this is going to be my office slash kind of studio. Um, and then this leads, of course, to the second story. We'll go up there soon. This is going to be our formal dining. So we already have a really beautiful set, a formal dining set that we're going to bring right over here. Um, from the other house, uh, this old school chandelier is going to have to go. I'm not feeling it. This one too, not feeling it. So all of this is going to be changed out. Um, you've got your guest bath here, which, you know, there's a lot we can do to dress this space up, Terrell. Um, so we'll try to make it super cute, make it very inviting. Um, then you have our living room. Blinds are closed, don't know how to open them yet, but I do love how high the ceilings are. Um, I feel really intimidated by this space right now. It's, it's, I don't know if you guys can tell, it's actually like just really massive. So yeah, we're thinking um, really mid-century modern vibes. We're thinking lots of plants. Um, and so again, this is gonna be a huge work in progress. So going to switch over to our master bedroom. This blue wall is going to have to go. Uh, we're thinking some wallpaper and stuff. Got to patch up the wall. But man, this room is massive. It's so much bigger than our current master bedroom at our house. So we are going to have to redo. I mean, we're going to have to get a lot more furniture. Um, loving our bathrooms. So um, we've got my tub, I'm super excited. I didn't have a tub in the other house, so I'm really excited about this. Of course, the showers, Nosh's bath, uh, Nosh's sink, this one's gonna be mine. Um, he took this closet. Um, I took this one, started putting some stuff in here already, but one thing that's really dope about this house um, is this random ass closet right here in the middle of other closets. Now it's a little bit weird, right? Like what are we gonna do with this space? But um, I actually do a lot of meditation. Um, so I'm gonna turn this into like my Zen den. 
<laughs> I'm gonna make it a really cool meditation space. So I'm excited about that. And of course, all my shoes are up here already. Um, then quick backyard vibes from our room, guys. So this is the view I get to wake up to. And I am like really excited, like straight up looks like I'm sleeping in a forest. So I am excited about this. All right, now we are headed over to the kitchen, which this kitchen and breakfast area. Hi, Nosh. Um, this is gonna be our breakfast area. Um, we're, we don't have a table yet. We're gonna have to figure that out. Kitchen, so much bigger, already messy. Um, and Nosh just ordered a fridge, so that's gonna go here. Of course, and we get a pretty nice sized like little laundry room right here too. So I like the fact that it's right next to the kitchen. That's kind of nice. All right, guys, this is going to be super dope. Lily's bedroom is the biggest bedroom I have ever seen for a kid. It's a whole second master bedroom. In fact, it might even be bigger than our room. This girl gets one, two, three, and four closets, which is insane. There's also this room door that she can sneak out of when she's a teenager, so I'm definitely gonna have to deadbolt that or something. All right, let's head on upstairs now. Um. To be very honest, I don't think the upstairs is gonna be used all that much. Um, we don't really, you know, we only have one kid, but um, there's a good number of bedrooms up there. So I'm not a huge fan of carpet. Eventually the carpet's gonna have to go, but I'm not even gonna tackle that right now. We do have a cute little bathroom up here. Where's the lights? I don't even know where lights are right now. Hey, and there's one room here. This one's another room. This is gonna be Nosh's office. And this is gonna be, um, I don't know what this is gonna be yet, but it's a really big room. So we'll figure it out or what's gonna go in here, but super big. So I wanna do something really cool with this space. Now let's go outside. Right, we are headed outside now, which none of this is set up yet with any of our furniture. All we have is one hammock in place, which um, that's not gonna go there. That's not gonna stay there, but anyway, you can see why we bought this house. I mean, literal forest and it goes down all the way, all the way back there. So we're, we have our garage here and we're gonna build a barn right there for our horse and for our other animals. Um, and one thing that's really cool is this is actually a six car garage. So, oh. all right, let's go in. Where's the lights in here? All right, so here we go. Three cars here, a little workstation here. Um, and then once you get in here, this is actually going to become a man cave. So this entire room, Nosh is going to turn into like a man cave game room. So we'll see how creative he gets. He said he doesn't want my help. So we will see. So, all right, that was the inside of the home tour. Um, right now, you know, just trying to get stuff over from the other house. Um, I'm not even really, really worried about decorating yet. I'm actually really intimidated by that process of how I'm gonna decorate the house and how I'm gonna make it look nice and all of that. So that's just gonna be like my 2021 project. I'm gonna go really slow. Of course, I'll be sharing with you guys as we complete each room, I'll share the progress with you guys. Um, as we raise our animals here, you know, the cooking projects that we do, the gardening projects we do, all of that will be, you know, vlogged. So thanks for joining us uh, on this journey into our new home.